Hello and welcome back to more Atlas single player. And yes, I'm in fly mode. Just because I wanted to have a quick little look at our ship. Apparently there's a level 108 crocodile just down there. Um, that's interesting. What level you, you, you just stay there. Anyway, so just want to have a quick look at our ship. I'm quite happy with it. I like the design that's come out. Now what we have to do is we have to outfit her. So she needs cannons. And she needs a lot of cannons. Um, we need, what, six down the bottom and then, say, like, four here and then, like, we'll, say, we'll, we'll just go with five up the top for now. So that's 15 each side. That's the same as I have on my multiplayer one. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll stick with that design for now. Nah, see how that goes. That'll be about. That'll be. Yeah, what's that? 30 cannons? So I'm gonna need like a. Yeah, I can stop flying now. Where's the water? Excuse me, water. Thank you. Much easier now. Okay, so what we need is 30 cannons to do all that stuff and things. Now I've got a bunch of cobalt cooking. No, I can't carry that much. It's so heavy. Here, what we can do is we can go like this and go like this, throw that up there, and oh, jeez, for a second I thought it disappeared. Excuse me, coming through. I just need to make cannons. Just one more step. There we go. Bam. Uh, cannon. So what do we need? Five. Have we got? It's going to be hide that we're going to have a bit of an issue with. Do we have any hide in here? Got a little bit. I like it when things come up sneaky. Okay, so we make another seven of those. Okay, and then I feel like what we're going to run out of is going to be the cobalt. So we're going to need to put cannons on each level of the deck. Now I spawned this guy in. He's my little commodities dude. He's the one that lets me recruit crew members. Um, he doesn't. He, he likes to think he's like some sort of god or something. And he floats. I'm the only god around here, sir. How dare you. Um, I, I, I can't fix it. I tried crouching and just put him halfway through the thing. So maybe I'll have to build him his own little shop. I can get rid of him. I figured it out. I just got to go cheat kill while looking at them and they disappear. So yay for that. This crocodile is just like straight up being annoying. Dude. Homie. No bueno. I need to go get the bear or something to kill it. But, um, it's going to take a minute for all of these cannons to cook up. So I want to put cannons all on the side. What else do I need on the ship? I'm going to need cannonballs, aren't I? Which I don't have right now. I don't have the coal, I think. Eh, I made it like a boss. Um, you have no, you're a fresh ship. There's nothing in you whatsoever. I've also discovered in my multiplayer series that ice is amazing, so I need to go... Rude. I need to go down and get a ice box production thing in my bob set up in the cold area. So once in a blue moon I can just flop, sail down there and, uh... Sail down there and take care of it. You know what, elephant? Are you capable of dealing with this? Excellent. Not even going to be in the way... Oh, it's flipping out. It doesn't like that this is happening. It's not a fan. Get some more level. Ha 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 Okay, there we go. Beautiful. Ugh. No, I want to be up here. Stop it, game. No. I don't agree with this situation. This situation is non-agreeable. Okay, there we go. Nope. Okay. Jeez. Alright, game. Calm down. There we go. Now I'm up on land. Yay. Where is lava? Haha, I made it. Suck it, water. Anyway, I'm going to wait till all these iron in cobalt ingots have uh, cooked themselves up. I'm going to slap together this ship, and then I think what we're going to do is, 
I've got to record, record, record. I don't have to record. I, that's what I'm doing now. I have to make a bunch of hire a bunch of crew members. How much gold do I have? 88. So I can hire whatever 88 divided by five is. So a few. All right. I could do the math in my head, but I just, my brain's not doing math right now. Um, so we can hire as many crew, or we can only hire 14, I want to say. There is no one else on this server to help me out, so I can max the crew levels out. Um, so, what's it, 15 is the base or something, isn't it? Can I look at the ship? Uh, yeah, so 15. I can get 15 crew members. So I can mean one entire broadside of the ship. Which would be cool. Oh, no, I can't because I've got to put four people in the sails. So I can almost mean an entire broadside. So what I'm thinking is, we'll mean one broadside and then every level we get... I think I'll put the first few levels into crew to have a whole broadside set up. Then we might go resistance a little bit. And then we'll go back to another 15 crew and then we'll balance between resistance and damage. Now this isn't going to be perfect. This is that's a very loud truck outside. How are you going? Very loud truck that's outside. Even though my driveway is a hundred freaking meters away, how is that truck so goddamn loud? I have no idea. Um, it's just a normal shipyard, isn't it? Yeah. So this is only going to get to level 41. This ship. So we got 41 levels. We have to put. 15, we have to put like at least 15. Uh, no, 19. Half the levels almost into crew, and then spread the rest out. So ten into uh, thingo and thingo. But that's fine because once I if I unlock the overdrive skill, uh, where is the overdrive skill? It's under captains, is it? I indeed have unlocked the overdrive skill. Boom! Once we have the overdrive skill like that, uh, it. <laughs> 15 cannon broadside, you should be able to get 2 or 3 shots off and there's not much that will withstand that even with just common cannons, let alone uh, advanced cannons which I'll eventually definitely be putting on there. So let me build this thing up, get everything up and running and once we come back we should be in a position to go blow some stuff up. Now don't we all love blowing things up? I love blowing things up. So we're going to go blow some things up. I don't have a, oh, that's right, I was cooking all my food on the ship which despawned. And I've just been dying to reset. <laughs> I've been lazy. I've just been letting myself die to reset things. So what do I need to make a goddamn fireplace? Okay, so I'm just going to quickly finish off making some cannonballs. Alright, actually we're going to need more bloody metal. Do I have any more metal in here? A little bit. Can you have this? Make some... Yeah, what's that going to give me, like a 200 something cannonballs? That should be enough to begin with. While that's doing that, I'm going to grab me gold, like so. And we're going to go grab ourselves some crew members. Now, I think I'll only be able to grab 10 crew members to begin with because of, uh, apparently you're only allowed to get 10 at a time, or 10 level 1 crew members in a cell at a time. But... They should be gaining experience pretty relatively quickly. Yeah. Okay, so if I can find an animal for these guys to punch. No, there's nothing on the beach anywhere nearby. Of course there isn't. Alright guys, let's go put you on your cannons. Now, I've only, um... I've only done one side of cannons. I haven't even bothered putting in the other side of the cannons yet. But that's not really that much of an issue, in my opinion. Are you guys, do you just fall through the, are you all, okay, you're all having issues with life at the moment. I need to put ladders on the side of this thing too. That probably would be a very good idea. Alright, let's climb up. Let's see what we can do. So we're going to have, so we need four for the sails. So you all are going to get in my way right now, aren't you? Okay. Eh. Bam. Everyone over here. And the elephant's going to come over here if I whistle to this point. Come on, you can do it. You all can get on the ship. How many are on the ship now? Okay, so they're all on the ship at least. So we can just... Go like this. 
Whistle somebody on that. Whistle somebody on that. There we go. Awesome. We need someone on this sail. Is there someone on it? I don't know. Did someone hop on it? Yes. Okay, and then finally, we need one person on this sail. Pretty sure I saw someone pop up in the corner of my eye. And then we can put the last six. We can go onto these cannons. That's right. I've got to wait for them to actually get to the cannon. Come on, you can do it. There we go. And then you. Hello. Where are there you are? How you going, buddy? Then the next one. Bam. Then the next one. Bam. And then there should be one left, shouldn't there? That'll be ten. Yep. Awesome. So we got ten so far. That's excellent. We have positions available for five more crew. That'll leave five cannons to be filled. So, um, how many we got here? We got one, two, three, four here. I just realised these guys are gonna block the hell out of this pathway. Uh, I should probably fix that. Maybe by moving the cannons a bit forward. Yeah, I move the other cannons a bit forward. I'll be able to fit through. It's, I haven't got five cannons up here anyway, never mind. I've only put these cannons in. So we'll put the four guys in this cannon, and then that'll give me a ten cannon broadside, which will be enough to start off with at least. Ow. So, that's some progress. Uh, actually, now I'm going to wait till these guys level. Rawr! Annoying. Can you level yet? You're almost level. Okay, well, I'm going to move the cannonballs on board. I'm going to level these guys up and get uh, my final four crew members. And then we're going to go poke those brigs that I saw on the other side of the island. If they're still there. They should still be there. I hope they're still there. I really want to poke them with a big giant stick. Alright guys, it's time for the first maiden voyage of the Dawnbreaker. And I do know that there is a brig around that corner because I moved the yucky ship over here and I saw it. <laughs> so, yay for that I suppose. But, first things first. I feel like we should probably get a little bit of target practice in. What do you guys think? You think target practice is a good idea? I think it's an awesome, awesome idea. Now, because these cannons are on two different levels, it's gonna take a little bit of a little bit of practice. Alright. See there's the brick. I told you I saw it out there. You think you think you can hide from me? No sorry, Bob. Okay. So Here's our enemy target practice. We've got to sink it before that turns green. So, let's just do this. Open up this. I want to try F6 and... You can fire. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, I don't know. The overdrive thing. Maybe I should get a bit more practice with the overdrive thing, eh? What do you guys think? Hoping this works. I know you in the multiplayer server. Yeah, it works. We can finally get rid of this blight on our existence. This disgrace. That is. Can I get like all the cannons lined up as much as possible? Fire. Uh, I said fire. There we go. Boom! 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 Back plank is missing, and she shall sink. Hopefully very soon we can get rid of this this disgrace this this enemy on our existence How much life have you got left? I kind of wanted to sink it here because I, I thought it'd be cool to have like a little shipwreck off this off the coast um, So I can get some use out of the yucky ship But it's taking a sweet time isn't it? Um, I still have the steering wheel. Yeah, can I just raise the anchor for a sec? go. Yeah, look at a sink. What a shame. You could sink a far, bit faster. I don't want to blow up any more of your decking. Maybe I should blow up some more of the decking. I don't know. I just want this ship to be gone. I just want it gone. Probably going to cut out the part that this takes because this looks seems like it's going to take a, just, a, just a hot minute. So... I'm going to sit here with the recording going, and hopefully I remember to cut this party out. Well, it's got to be getting close now. 
The damn deck is full of water. There's an internal swimming pool that for some reason isn't leaking out the side. Oh, I love this sometimes. It's taken forever to get just to get to this point. I mean, come on. Like, you got a giant hole, you're missing planks. I suppose that's a bit weird. How would you sink from that, even though the, it's above the waterline? I don't know, whatever. Alright. I'm not a genius. I'm just sitting here, staring at a deck that is now covered with water, hoping that this thing will sink sometime soon. I feel like I've been waiting forever. There was actually a tiger out there somewhere I was watching. I was just staring at it, running around, killing everything. I took my eyes off it for a minute to play on my phone, and then now it's gone. Are you sunk yet? <laughs> Wait, what are we down to? 14 health? Okay, 13 health? Okay, yay, yay, come on now. You can do it, sink your ship. You can do it, sink the ship. Jesus, this taking like a hot minute. I found some maps on the shoreline earlier. Whoa, what the hell? Well, okay. I'm guessing... Okay, well I guess the single player stats are finally morphed because I was also... When I harvested it up middle before, I got like 5,000 out of one node. So I guess... Yucky ship, <laughs> look at that. That's a pretty big name title. I like it. But, um... Oh. <laughs> I liked. Yeah, anyway. The ship should be sunk by now. But yeah, I, I, I don't know. I'm guessing the... That, um... The times 10 never actually went through until recently. All the stats. Are you... Are a bit, how are you? Like, look at this. There is a thin layer of water above the top of the ship now. How are you not sunk yet? This is not logical, sir. Sir, you're not playing into logic. Here we go. Any moment now. Any moment. Hey! I mean, oh, no. Hey, our ship sunk. Oh. What a shame. Yeah, I don't know how long this is going to last. I looked online. Apparently, on five days, within five days, the unofficial this thing would despawn. But this is single player, so I don't know. But I think that's kind of cool. We now have a shipwreck. Now, maybe if we actually did demolish some of the sides or something like that, to make it look like it's mostly salvaged. But we'd have to leave some pieces in, otherwise it would completely despawn. But yeah, let's go poke that damn brig now. Now that that ship is finally sunk. Yeah, got rid of that ugly thing. Man, I missed my first schooner. I'm gonna have to remake it, aren't I? Yeah, yeah, I'm totally am. Totally am. Where's my scene? It's on the right hand side. Why do I? I'm stuck. This is not intelligent design, Smokey. But it looks nice. And looks uh, awesome. Yeah, so anyway, like I was saying earlier, I think the, my. In the last world, my single player stats didn't actually affect these things because. There's, <laughs> yeah, they're a lot, <laughs> a, lot, a lot more gold in them now than there was before. Remember how I changed the loot quality in the in the settings and stuff or something and I thought that I built I buggered it up because the, uh, the the army of the damned were really high level and I thought it was weird and out of place but it wasn't that was actually just the normal levels yeah I don't think my last world my single player my um, stats were really increased that maybe I stop in a freaking thing but Jesus map developer sneaky little bastard there's a manda there Oh, can I turn around? This is, you, that damn brig, he baited me into this. He knew it was here. He was like, I'm going to get this sucker. Ah, you should, you should have come and try sunk me. That would have been perfect time. Oh, that ship looks cool in the distance back there. Okay, can we turn around? Are we out of this thing? Are we no longer bogged on the damn sand? Come on. Or beached or whatever they call it in beach term, in ship terms. Let's go. Let's get around. No, no, turn around. Alright, turn! Turn! Turn, you heavy bastard! It's actually not heavy. Okay. Excellent. Alright, where is this enemy ship on my shoreline? It's gotta be on my right. Okay, excellent. It's apparently parking itself. You can park yourself as much as you want, as long as you're aware of the you're about to get shot in the face situation. Alright, you are aware of this? This is a thing? Uh, apparently you're backing up. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. I smashed into the shoreline. Yeah, I see that. 
Okay, come on. The wind is of course not cooperating. But when does it ever? Alright, Mr. Brick. Alright, Mr. Text Message. Um let's see. No, listen. I need you to stay on the right. Hey! Oi! Oh, cool, dude. I probably should let the AI handle this. Oh, I already took off one of his planks. I'm gonna crash into the shoreline. <laughs> no, no, my cannons are on the other side. This is a terrible, <laughs> terrible situation. No, you stupid ship. Turn. Turn, you little ship. Go on the right hand side. Go on my right hand side. Yes. Yes. Go on the right. Go on the right. Go on the right. I don't know what that does. Are we just... This is, uh... <laughs> this is an interesting tactic. If you want to attack this, guys, that'd be cool. Feel free. Uh, I'm really good. Hey, don't shoot the front of my ship. That's rude. Only I get to shoot things. See, like that. I'd love it if I can get this sunk on the shoreline too. That'd be cool. I'd love to have a bunch of shit. What do you think? Do you think that'd be cool? Hey. Hey. Not cool, dude. Not cool. I help it, uh... Oh, I don't have any. Okay, well, this is bad because I didn't bring any resources to the bear. I do have planks in that spare, at the very least. These are actually tougher than I thought. I suppose if I just sailed away like a little sea, eventually it, and it has no planks and there's no people there to actually repair it. But certainly is taking a chance of way. Yeah. I was worried I may have wasted the um look at it. It's just sitting there and it's like, hey, hello. Why is the bloody schools taking care of the food in? i to figure out how to use that overdrive cannon reload. Don't know what I was worried about. That was nice and easy. Guys, the butts are in the way. Oh, I can get through there. Excellent. Yeah, look at the enemy ship sink. Wait, how deep is it? How deep is the water here? <laughs> Not that. Wow. Okay then. Didn't realize that was that deep. Well, rip my idea of having another shipwreck on the side of the ship. Can I get in here and like? Can I just? Maybe steal these. Actually, you know what? Uh, skills. Piracy skills. Where's the salvage plunderer thing? Is that it? Bam. Uh, can you be gone for a sec? Thanks. Whoa, hold on. Kind of getting turned around a little bit. <laughs> I just want your alloy. Whoa, that wasn't what I wanted to do. Well, maybe if I paid more attention to what I'm doing... Can I get the cannon? Apparently I can't uh, salvage these cannons. Fine, be that way. I didn't want to salvage the cannons anyway. Stupid head. Stupid, stupid head! Kind of wanted you up on the shoreline though, not gonna lie. Well, you know what guys, that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. We got the Dawnbreaker out on her first... ...sail? Her first cruise or something? It was really pretty successful. We sunk two enemy ships, and we gained apparently three levels, so we're going to put them into extra crew because I need more crew. And I should probably stock up on materials to repair the ship, and get back to base, and then actually repair the ship. So that's going to be it for this episode, I hope you enjoyed it, I think I've said that already. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I don't know how long this episode is, but I, either way, I hope you enjoyed it, and until next time, have a good one. Bye! Now we get the ship back to base, repair it, and don't have any resources. 
This is what happens when you take out new toys and just sit there and do broadsides. Silly time.